Hvaiolua! Yay! Hvaiolua, Tim! Hvaiolua! Yeah, we're learning Finnish. Yeah. Because that's a normal person thing to do. Yeah. Actually, I don't know. I'd like to learn another language. That was the only thing. Yeah, I didn't let Sam see how this, how it was spelled, Tim. What's your name? <laughs> My name is Adam. So demanding. <laughs> My name's Adam, but I'm not even up yet, Tim. I'm not either, Adam. I'm Tim, but I'm not up yet either. Adam. Yeah, well, you already <laughs> went, Tim. Tim already <laughs> went. Bye, Yolua. <laughs> and we're flipper Yolua. flicks. Wait a second. It's Hawaii Yolua. Hawaii Yolua. Yeah, I know. Hi, Yole, man. That's Merry Christmas in Finnish. Yeah. It is. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> According to Google Translate, let's make sure we say that. <laughs> yeah, they, they have, that's the highest frequency, and then Hauska Yolua is lesser frequent. What was that? Hauska. Hauska. Yolua. Hauska Yolua. start saying that a lot. Vittu. 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 What are you saying? I said fuck about ten times. <laughs> <laughs> We're just like, We're like what is he doing? <laughs> uh, I can just throw in some lort if you want. That's shit Dan- Danish for shit. Oh, Pasca. All right, Sam. Come on. Where's your curse word that you learned in Latin? <laughs> <laughs> That's the first thing they teach you in Latin. Is what about Greek? Word. Ancient Greek. <laughs> no. Lo siento. Lo siento? I'm sorry. That's Spanish? <laughs> yeah. That is Spanish for I'm sorry. Damn it, I'm sad that I knew that. <laughs> I didn't know it because I don't know it. But Anyways, you know, Tim, you and I can just keep talking because, you know, we're not up. Oh, shit. Am I up? Correct. <laughs> Gosh, you guys just kept talking, and I was like, "Somebody's hey, gonna, Yola. yeah, somebody's gonna pick up Hi, slack. Yola. Like, who is it? Hey, oh my! Well, if I remember, I might put this out on Christmas so that you guys can see how it's spelled, so that you can practice oh, God, amongst that's your 20, family. That's right. twenty twenty one days away. Right? But I probably will forget because it's twenty one days away from now. Anywho, but you can be sure. Well, maybe you can't be sure. Can you? You can Who maybe knows, sometimes man. be sure that I'll post stuff on social media or Adam will. Yes, please. <laughs> she needs that asterisk now because I helped catch up. Yeah. Uh, but anywho, sometimes we're on social media. And we're going to make Tim do it next year. Yeah, we might as Whoa. well. And <laughs> it's on Instagram and Twitter at Flipperflix. And we have a website as well where you can recommend films for us like this one. Uh, flipperflix.com pretty easy easy you know you can find us anywhere and we release episodes every Thursday at 1pm eastern time you'll find them on Apple, Spotify, Google Breaker the list goes on and on we still owe you that episode where we just read them all to you one of these days we'll get there and uh, <laughs> you can review us on Apple that'd be great if you like us if you don't like us I mean that'd still be great too love your feedback on how we pronounced this. You know, how good we did there. We did fantastic. Actually, that would be it. great if you guys could just spam our apple with whether or not we did a good job of pronouncing <laughs> that. <laughs> but just don't ask us how to say Killian Murphy's name. Yeah. Because I said it right this time, but episode two. Oh, it's silly. Ooh, oh, episode two. We, we went far into that hole. <laughs> Sorry, Killian. Anywho. If you could review us, that'd be cool. If not, that's cool, too. And take it away, Tim. Adam. Adam. Who? <laughs> but So we watched the movie Rare Exports, A Christmas Tale or something. Sometimes it has the extra part on it. Okay. Um, IMDb just says Rare Exports. Mm-hmm. Uh, so this is our holiday episode. Yay, Christmas. Yeah. And <laughs> what? You're, yeah. 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 It's just a high, super high pitch. Anyways. Um, That's just my voice, man. We watched it on Hulu. Yes. I think we own it, though. We do. Because that's a normal thing to own. <laughs> I know. Hasn't everybody seen this film and they own it, too? Right. I mean, come on. Correct. Well, the, synop- the, the <laughs> synopsis of this film is, In the depths of the Corvutunturi Mountains, 
486 meters deep, lies the closest ever guarded secret of Christmas. The time has come to dig it up. This Christmas, everyone will believe in Santa Claus. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, that's the synopsis. Nice. Better um, believe that. So, we picked this because Sam and I have watched it a few times. We liked it. It's To us, it's like the movie The Room, where you try and just show people it because it's like, what the fuck? Mm-hmm. Kind of that situation. Um, but we didn't tell Tim that part. I think we just were like, Tim, we should watch this for the holiday episode. And you're like, okay. Yeah. No but to be fair, it's like kind of more of a horror Christmas film. I would Is it say really scary? No. no. But it's not your typical holly jolly Christmas film. So I thought it would be up his alley. Yeah. Potentially. Sure. sure. And then I can roll into my expectations real quick. Might as well. Um, I expected to see Old Man Dong because I've seen this movie. <laughs> um, and I don't get scared from this movie, but you know, I do get a little concerned sometimes after this movie that just some old dude will be standing out in my yard staring at me <laughs> with a potato sack. Um, and I'm nowhere near the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> so that'd be real concerning. It'd be real concerning, concerning. Like, where'd you come from, bruh? Where did you go? Um, but yeah, so that was my, I enjoy this film. Again, it's one of those ones we like to put people through. But how are you, Tim? Uh, I didn't know what this was. <laughs> I just clicked on it and clicked play. I didn't see the no questions synopsis, asked. nothing. No I just questions and asked. Ma- majority of the time, that's all I do. And it's probably a bad habit. <laughs> I mean, be- I mean, sometimes... You try so the whole idea behind it is like judging a book by its cover, right? Uh-huh. Like I just look at the front, and I'm like, all right, cool, that's the name, that's the cover, let's fire away and just see like if I have any idea what's going on. It's spoiler, most of the time the first ten minutes I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Tim's just trying to catch up and I'm, I'm waiting for the setup for the plot before I fucking <laughs> I'm waiting as the the patient audience for them to explain the plot to me. <laughs> the whole so. plot. <laughs> Yeah, no, I I mean, I was down to watch it. Always are. I had no, I don't know, I was very neutral about it, I feel. Because I was like, oh, it's going to be a holiday movie. I'm just, you know, they probably picked some fun little movie to watch. (laughs) (laughs) I I really appreciate that that was. (laughs) I will say that when he came on before we started recording, he was like, did I watch the right thing? Was it, was it subbed? Yeah. Then yeah, you did. (laughs) Because this movie is, I would say, 95% in Finnish. Yeah, I think the English... There's very little in English. Yeah, like at the beginning and then like one little spot later. Yeah. Yeah, so if you don't like subtitles, wah, wah. You're out of luck. Uh Mm Oh. Okay, but now what are your expectations, Sam? Were you expecting Old Man Dong? (laughs) Yeah, and uh, I was expecting Vube. Vupe, this girl, this girl here <laughs> yells for Vupe all the time T- throughout the year. Yeah, Vupe. And then I, I can remember the whole plot of the movie, but I'll never remember Vupe's fucking name. <laughs> I just love the name. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I actually, so I don't know if we watched it last year. We I kind of feel like we skipped it. And so it had been, like it was a tradition for a couple of years, and then we skipped it. And so I had actually kind of forgotten some of it, which I was pleased about because it made it like all over again. You know, it's like Christmas morning all over again. <laughs> this lovely movie. <laughs> and, uh, Tim, you're like, how did you guys find it? So do you remember our friend Tim? You're Tim. Do you remember our friend Zach when we were like, he would go out with us at Miami? Uh-huh. So around Christmas, he's like, okay, I've got this terrible movie to show you guys. So he found it on the internet uh, because at the time it was really unknown. Yeah, it wasn't anywhere. Yeah. So we got, we ended up watching it with them and we're like, well, that's fun. And then we, when we moved to Florida, we showed it to somebody and the girl we showed it to said she had to sleep and make, like, she was freaked out that Santa was going to be outside her window. (laughs) 
Um, <laughs> staring. staring. <laughs> just staring. Um, but so, yeah, it's like one of those movies we like to show people. Mm-hmm. Like the room. There. Yeah. But yeah, spoilers if you've not seen this. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. How do, well, how do you want to start, Sam? <laughs> I mean, you could set the stage with like the movie opens Finland. and you get your like. Five seconds of English. Okay, it was probably like three minutes. It was like, yeah, three or five minutes. Yeah. Uh, and all you know is like this guy is drilling into the mountain. Does he even say what he's <laughs> looking for at that point? No. No. They just find he, like no, sawdust, they, right? Know, really. They find yeah. sawdust and then he gives them safety orders. That yeah. Says, right. Wash behind your ears. <laughs> it's like, yeah, the guy the is like, is this wash guy? behind your ears. That's and fucking he's dumb. like, no, You're take it seriously. Like, seriously. <laughs> You're not going to want to curse around here. Yeah, exactly. And he just, like, rolls his eyes. Next thing you know, we got... Do you remember their names? Um, oh, my gosh. We just U- watched this. Yeah. It was, like... Was it Uso? Uso? Uso. Yeah, Uso. Uso um, and Pietra. Pietori. Oh, really? I thought it was Pietra. It might be. It might have a different translation in IMDb. Is, or I'm just... I don't know. Anyways, Peter. You can call him Peter if you want. That's nah. the English name. Anyway, yeah, they're just like... like Peter Gray or whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they're just chilling on the side of a mountain. Which, how the fuck's they get up there? <laughs> they're, for perspective, they're what, like 10, you think? If even? Oh, he's like the seven. Kids. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're like, young. I thought this was some weird fucking... Just this scene right here with the Kraken... <laughs> I thought this was like, all right, we're in the future. Like, these kids have <laughs> guns. Like, all right, cool. <laughs> I was like, yeah, so I forget that Tim future. wasn't aware. <laughs> <laughs> and then they start, start speaking Finnish, and you're like, wait, what? I was like, what? all right, okay. <laughs> well, please note that Yusuf's got this terrible mullet. Oh, it's, it's so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> it's pretty great, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> It's great in a terrible sense. Oh, man. In my opinion. I forgot what it was like to see this for the first time. Tim, I, I kind of just want to let you talk for an hour. <laughs> because it's, it's just, like, so crazy. But, but seriously, though, they take forever. Like, they go up and down that mountain in, in daylight time. Yeah. And it's, right. I'm pretty sure that since they're so far north, the sun sets at, like, 4 p.m. Yeah, probably. And doesn't rise. Like, they have less daylight time. But later on in the film, they ride snowmobiles up and it takes longer. Yeah, right. it's like, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Because <laughs> we're like, wait, weren't they just, like, chilling on the mountain like the kids were? Yeah. But nah, they got back during daylight. Oh my gosh, what a mess. But so, And, like, right off the bat, Pietra is like... It's fucking Santa Claus. Yeah, which is like, what? what? I don't even know, like, okay, so they're, <laughs> I was pretty lost. Uh, yeah. Understandably. Well, until he gets into explaining it, because, like, so they're fracking, and they're like, we found it, dig it out, take it, let's go, and I'm like, I'm yeah. like are you English? What is happening? Time out. Like, I just want you guys English, to know, but... Tim is nailing that accent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, to a T. Straight up. But... And time out. <laughs> So, like, I'm like, all right, cool, they got some artifact thing. And then it goes back to the kids, and, like, then they're, like, trying to get reindeer. And I'm I'm not really sure what they're doing. I'm like, are they, like, they want them for food? Yeah, yeah. so they kill the, they collect reindeer and murder them all for their food. I think they sell them. I don't think they murder them. Oh, yeah, they, I think they, they murder them and sell them, because they talk about how their freezers are going to be filled with meat. Yeah. Right, but... I think they sell them too. Yeah, because they have to. That's the whole like, like joke. As reindeer, He's... right? Yeah. But like, well, I didn't catch on to any of that. I just thought they were like dystopian future, <laughs> and they're, that's their only source of food. And for some reason, like, I can't <laughs> about the dudes fracking the mountain because I was like, "What's happening with this shoddy ass fence and these kids with guns, dude?" And then the kids getting like pushed around, but like. Yeah. Sam has to cover her face right now. And then, well. And then the kids talk about Santa Claus. I'm like, I think you mean Krampus, but. Krampus is from a different country. Yeah, I don't care. 
you talking about Krampus. <laughs> yeah, like Pietro, like always has a gun around. He's walking around his <laughs> he house. Really got got a gun. Gun. <laughs> Slung on his shoulder. <laughs> no big deal. <sighs> they were it. selling the food, the, selling something, because there was a running joke about adding VAT. Yeah, adding like the, the tax taxes. Rate. Yeah. It's 85000 plus this VAT. And you're like, right. 22%. 22% VAT. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then, I'm sure Vupe. I remember the first time I watched this. I was Vupe. like, what the fuck? Who the fuck is Vupe? <laughs> Vupe is like the little stuffed dog that he has on a leash. It's a he... dog? Yeah, what the fuck? I think it's supposed to be a dog. It doesn't look like a dog. It's just <laughs> like a hairy leash. blob that he trails behind him. And like the first night, I mean, Pietro is like kind of, he's like, he's got it all under control, right? He oh, knows it's Santa. He knows. And he knows genius. that Santa's going to come and get him because he's been naughty. Like, and why so, like, does the... he even think that, though? <laughs> all That's of that research he did. <laughs> he has, like, 20 books on but Santa. Why did he do that? Like, <laughs> Who has that much books on Santa? <laughs> it's his I don't pastime. know. I was into the Santa eating the naughty kids, like, <laughs> and shit. Like, whatever. Putting okay. him in a cauldron. He was like, okay, I can understand this. I can get behind this. I like Krampus anyway, so I'm down. Just don't steal his thunder, you know? Yeah, yeah. And then, for, you so always, like, threatening this kid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, he gets his revenge later, though. Yeah, like, they cut the hole in the fence, and he's like, don't tell him about it. And then, right. like. 473 deer die. <laughs> reindeer to the wolves to wolves yeah because that's what? how nature they're works like they don't starved wolves and all of a sudden they're eating every deer in sight <laughs> <laughs> they just all happen to be in one fucking section too yeah. right obviously also wolves don't do that <laughs> no not really <laughs> well they don't know <laughs> well, clearly <laughs> And then, like, <laughs> whatever. I mean, Pietro's dad is kind of a dick to it because. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> whatever, he, whatever he's. His like, real father. Oh, really? That's their father son, IRL. Nice. I thought um, that's weird because the whole time I didn't think he looked anything like him, but. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed very odd to me. <laughs> I know. But their actual father and son. Yeah. And he's always just kind of sassy, like. Pietro comes out there and he's like asking him about something and he's like the wolves are gonna gobble you up. Right. Like I don't have time for I'm stupid not questions. <laughs> like he's so salty. It's great. I just love the dialogue in this movie. There's like so good. many instances where you're like, oh my god, great. And I don't know if it's a translation thing. I like to believe it's not. I like to believe that's how it was written, but yeah. it could be. <laughs> yeah, it could definitely be. And then. You got Mr. fucking um, Pete Pernan or whatever his name is. <laughs> Peter Pan. Peter Pan. We're going to call him Peter Pan. Okay. Who wears his sunglasses. <laughs> all the time. At all times. <laughs> it's nighttime. Sunglasses on. He's in the middle of a building. Sunglasses on. <laughs> the only time is you got to give it to him, though. He's really great with those sunglasses as a prop because whenever he's amazed, he takes them off. And That's it's only true. like twice. <laughs> <laughs> so he's really just like wearing them sunglasses, man. Also, every time I watch this, this is one of the outside of um, Vupe's fucking name that I cannot remember. Yeah. I always think that's uh, Yuso's dad. Uh huh. Sunglasses man versus Imo or. Yeah, Amo. Yeah. I don't know why. I always. He just see, He just looks more like Peter Pan. Yeah. I can see that. Than Imo. Oh, also known as Finnish Willem Dafoe. <laughs> Tim sees it. <laughs> yeah. And then I, in my head I was calling... Um... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it does look like it. It's hard to see. I know. <laughs> say that, I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I was calling in my head the other guy, um, Finnish Jeff Bridges. Okay. Oh, okay. Like a young, young Bridges, not current. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I didn't say that one out loud to you when we were watching. Um... But, yeah, so all the deer get eaten. All the reindeer get eaten. Yep. Mm-hmm. By rabid wolves, Alleged definitely. Wolves. Allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. But 
Pietra knows it wasn't wolves because yeah. he he's he just found a footprint. He yeah. found a fucking yeah, footprint, but find the footprint. doesn't alert anybody. Like, hey, this is a human footprint. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he says to Uso, like, no, it was Santa Claus, and then Uso's like, Uso is like, you're fucking don't go away, just go. Yeah, away. he's just like constantly dismissing him. Well, in in Yuso's defense, it's a little far fetched that Santa Claus went and murdered four hundred seventy three reindeer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he true. Doesn't bitches. he need them? Yeah. <laughs> Sam, I'm gonna side with Yuso on this one part. <laughs> <laughs> Just this once. No, he's kind of a prick otherwise. Yeah. And then it's, well, and what did you think about, because this is, like, towards the very beginning, when the dad hangs up, like, the pig. Oh, yeah. With the mouth, Tim. Oh, Were you, yeah. like, really confused then, too? <laughs> I, I was. I I was like, okay, so, we're in the future. It's dystopian. <laughs> I don't know why I thought the future. It could have been some other time frame. It could have been current time, different world. I don't because know. Because it's the future. And I was like, all right, he's got, like, a little farm and... And then he's got a full fledged butcher shop. What? I'm like, the people, is he like the butcher? I, this was, I, yeah. Just, <laughs> I yeah. I should have read the synopsis for this one. <laughs> I was way off the entire time. Until I like halfway through. Yeah. When they, you know, Santa Claus shows up. But, well, his elf. Right, that's what I'm yeah. saying. You know. Dingling and ding dong. Yeah. Version but, one. Yeah. So he has stolen the pig's bait mm. at this point and fallen into the trap. Fell in the, the illegal hole. fell into the illegal hole. Gotcha. Right, yeah, because apparently they were just going to chop up a body. They were just going to straight <laughs> up of like cut saying, him into pieces. Oh, he fell in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's like... cut that full butcher shop. You might as well, you know? Right, like at that point. Also, they look at the fucking U.S. passport and they look at it and right. then look at him. Yeah. Clearly not the same I guy. <laughs> no, but, you know, he just fell in a hole. <laughs> and he aged about 60 <sighs> years. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> Which I do think they say something about that. Cause they said like, he's, he's not even 60. 60. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, or something like that, yeah. So they did, like, they, they did bring caught it up. some of it, I guess, apparently. But Vupe, not Vupe, fucking Vupe. <laughs> Vupe. Vupe doesn't watch guard and gets in trouble. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Yeah. Anywho. Pietra? Pietra is like peering through the window and then runs off. And then somehow the one cop in this small yeah. village. I, I was like, where'd this cop come in the future? I thought they were like Mad Max shit going on. <laughs> Sam's <laughs> over here like. Lost. Sam's over here like, did he just get into a stranger's car? I'm like, the dad just said it was the cop. Yeah, but I was, like, at that point, I think I was, like, looking down or looking for, or maybe petting the cat. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention, so I missed that. And so I was like, what the hell? (laughs) But you've seen this. I know, but it's been a couple years. (laughs) (laughs) No, not that lost. (laughs) But, like, he never tells the cop, like, what's happening, but they go to Imo's house, and he's just like, look what I found in Yuso's bed. The, like kid dead kid situation like the straw like hat the, yeah. yeah the straw doll but it's of, like a life-size doll right yeah well i used to put pillows in my bed and i would run off and chase girls yeah it's totally normal it's totally normal your son has never showed yeah, an ignore, interest in this yeah just the fact that he's gone it seems like they don't really yeah i know also the fact that i did love how the cop was like you, the, you're not the weirdest thing that's happened to me today. Right. Yeah. Everybody's lost their radiator. And hair dryer. And hair dryers and ovens. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I feel like everybody losing their ovens and shit would be like, oh, okay, that's weird. But ev- however many pounds of corn he had and all they took was the sacks. I mean. Potatoes? <laughs> the potatoes. Oh, yeah. The yeah, potatoes. Yeah. Something. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. that's much weirder. That's super <laughs> yeah. weird. Also, I like how they're like, yeah, this guy's got potato sex. Let's fucking raid him. <laughs> yeah, we need how those. No. <laughs> they smelled the potatoes. Know. Yeah. They can smell children. So, yeah, probably potatoes. Like, what age do they stop smelling the kid, though? Like, is it like 18 and it's like no longer a, um, 
No longer has a scent? Probably, yeah. Yeah, but then they still kill the old people. Or, they like, do, the adults. Yeah. They do. Yeah. The ones that aren't important for the plot. The They're ones right. <laughs> <laughs> the ones also that, I guess, don't follow the safety precautions. You know, they didn't wash behind their ears, so they get Yep, they didn't out. wash behind their ears. That's probably why that dude's ear got bit. He yep, was probably just trying is. to help him out there. Yeah. Let me just wash that real quick for you. <laughs> well, now it's bloody. You're going to have to wash it. Yeah, duh. Jesus. Yeah, this guy, they, like, basically strung him up, though, eventually. Just, like, hung him up. Yeah, and they're all the sitting there just, like, eating pretzels looking at him. Yeah. No, <laughs> they weren't eating bread. pretzels. Yeah, they were oh. eating the gingerbread. <laughs> Throughout the film, they're eating that gingerbread, which... Like constantly. <laughs> Pietra, Pieter, whatever, who's fucking That's how it. you know it's Christmas time, guys. Pietori. Pietra? Whatever. He was, like... He eats the gingerbread and looks like he fucking hates it. Yeah. I know. And he's, he's like, it's good, Dad. <laughs> Just then, like Mom used to make. And then everybody's eating it throughout the film. I'm like... Is it actually good? Yeah, like, is this legit? Like, do I need the recipe? <laughs> I'm not a big gingerbread person. No, me you aren't? Mm-mm. I will eat it out of spite, but I don't love it. How do you eat it out of spite? <laughs> well, because... Uh, Okay, I'll make a gingerbread house, and then people are like, nobody likes gingerbread houses. Why don't we make gingerbread houses? Uh-huh. And then I will eat it just to spite them. Okay. It hurts my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> it's very hard. We need to yeah. make fresh gingerbread. That yeah. That way it's not so hard. Because, like, we'll buy it, and I'm like, eh, I'm not going to eat it. Because right. it's, like, really hard. <laughs> but I don't attack you for eating it. You don't. Other people do. I have been attacked in the past, being like, nobody eats that. And I'm like, you put enough fucking frosting on it, it tastes amazing. Right. <laughs> Sweets and the gummies. The salt for everything. <laughs> yeah. But anywho, theirs didn't have any frosting, so no, it, it must have been good. Boring ass ginger bread. Yeah. <laughs> ass gingerbread. <laughs> ass Would <bread>. you? <laughs> yeah. Would you drink ginger ale while you ate your gingerbread? <laughs> I would do now. I know. I was like, Tim, let, uh, put that on the beer, notes. Some gingerbread. <laughs> yes. Is ginger beer, beer the same shit as ginger ale? No. Okay. But probably. I think it is. Yeah. But at the same I mean, time, it tastes it, different. Yeah. I was like, yeah. ale and beer are synonymous. Yeah, that's true. I think it's more punched up though, like more gingery. Yeah. It definitely. Yeah, like, yeah it definitely has more of a ginger like flavor to it. As beer. Mm-hmm. Cause like isn't it like a Moscow mule? Yes. Use ginger, ginger beer? beer? Yep. Mm-hmm. Nobody never ginger ale. It's always ginger beer yeah, specifically. Ginger beer. And then um who is that fucking Australian company that makes root beer, Sam? They're like smaller bottles, but they also make ginger ale. Buntisberg or something? Buntaberg. Buntaberg. They make ginger beer, not is ginger ale. This weird future movie too? No, it's from something else. Shoot. No, it's from, it's on the Friendship Bundian. Billy Boyd and... Dominic Monaghan. Yeah, they drink Bundaberg ginger beer. And love it. Yeah, and I've always wanted to try it. I mean, I but try. we got it's their so cream good. soda or something. Yeah, it's at Kroger. You can find it. Yeah. Ooh, we yeah. saw it at the Beachmont Kroger, specifically. <laughs> so, if you need to try it. Yeah, if you need to try um, it. But... Okay, so, so they got Santa was, strung up. They got Santa strung up. Eating Yuso the gingerbread. Gone. Drinking the ginger ale. Or I guess drinking. what they're beyond the strung up part because the kid's gone, or is that after? The kids are gone. Yeah. Because oh, Peter, yeah. Peter, he was calling all his friends to see if they're around, and they're all missing. Yeah, he's yep. a very smart kid. <laughs> yeah. Which Tim, how did you feel about that? I was okay with this situation because. Somebody I thought needed it was to be. in the future, and, <laughs> and the kid fucking. No, at this point, I was more grounded into like, okay, this is probably more modern, and he's talking about Santa. <laughs> they got a dude that is Santa, you know, trapped in the basement. I don't know how he's fucking deadly when he's just down there, strung up, hanging out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, I was waiting for the horror part to start. <laughs> um. <laughs> I, I don't know. I felt fine about how, what the kid was doing in this one. Until the end. 
I, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not there yet, now. I Because I know that, Tim, you, in the past, you have talked about how you, like, when the kids are the super saviors. Right, when they're just too far, yeah. Hashtag yeah. monster family. Kids don't have the mental capacity. For, but anyway. They can snow, they can slow snow. Um, <laughs> yeah, slow-mo snow. Yeah. Uh, they start trying arguing with, the American business owner of the fracking company. And it's just like, bring Santa Claus. Just bring Santa Claus. Yeah. yeah. He's like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> and they're like, I, I like how they just ask for $85,000. Right. They yeah. don't ask for any more. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> that'll and the one guy's the like, losses. we could ask for a million. Yeah. <laughs> Sunglasses, man. Yeah. But they eventually bring him up, and he's, like, in this cage, and then when they're driving, what is it? He, like, looks through, that staring at... That creepy. He, like, looks through <laughs> at the kid, and you're like, oh, boy, he about to get it's, it. it's funny, because, like, I'm sure it was creepy the first time I saw it, but now I just laugh at it. It's I'm like, funny, yeah. yeah. Just I, smell him. <laughs> I, like, looked away. Like, I think I got up to get a glass of water, and all I hear is a burst of laughter. <laughs> it's just so funny. <laughs> This whole movie is funny to Sam. Yeah, it's a classic. Also, <laughs> also, I love that he always tell the kid always tells his um, Vupe to fucking stay. Yeah. But then he never listens to his own dad. Yeah. Boy, yeah, that's how it works. That's how it goes, man. So we've got showing up with Santa for ransom. Mm-hmm. And then they find all the heaters and they're like, <gasps> they're Well, no, thong. you forgot the well, fucking no, no. pickaxe that went in his like, head. Like, Hold oh, yeah. up, this ain't Santa. That's an I, elf. That is a, one of his little helpers, which was weird. <laughs> because he's yeah, just an old dude. <laughs> he yeah. definitely has Santa fe- qualities. Yeah, but I, 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 I did really enjoy that all of a sudden he was like, no, nah, this ain't Santa, this is an elf. And then he's like freaking out, and then a fucking pick. And just pick gets in head, and you're like, uh... uh <laughs> and I was expecting Santa right there. Instead, I saw a bunch of naked old dudes. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of naked old dudes. And I was like, all right, well, do these They're guys... They're shooting the breeze. Like, how do these guys get recruited? <laughs> are, 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 are these, like, guys that they've, like, taken before? What is going on here? Were they in the hole? Yeah, I don't know. I assumed they were. Yeah. But maybe they weren't. I, I don't think know. they were. I have no idea. Are these like were they normal looking back before Santa was frozen? Oh. And then he fucking knows the entire history of Santa being frozen. And he was frozen for like a long time. Yeah. yeah. Frozen long time. Long time. Yes. Very scientific amount of time. Long time. <laughs> I Much thought it was long. like four hundred years, right? Everything has to be like four hundred seventy three. Yeah, yeah, it's like four hundred years. But yeah, they think. What? I think it was like 400. Yeah. I was just saying, like, because the mountain is 486 meters tall. They killed like 473 reindeer. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Something with that number. Um, But yeah, they just see this, all these radiators and all the kids in the fucking potato sacks. Yes. But they're like, we got to turn off all these radiators. Guy just kicks a radiator. I'm just like, just kicks it. Yeah. That'll <laughs> work. That, that'll that turn it off. Yeah. Not really. You, Hardcore. I typically go for the power source. Mm. Highly no. recommend it. But I'm guessing, Tim, at this point, the kid's plan is what pisses you off. Well, I mean, it was like not so much his plan, but I'm like, yeah, it's his plan. Cause, uh, <laughs> and then he just like does it. And they're just like, yeah, yeah, all right, cool. This kid came up with a plan. And I'm like, all right, sweet. Wait, Which we'll is fine. He's allowed to come up with plans. These kids are staying in their fucking sacks. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious. I'm pretty sure some just... of them would have died. <laughs> Probably. It was just like, can't I be out of the sack? No, you so. You have to stay because it's my plan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was, that cool. was amazing. <laughs> and then he like can then hangs on to the fucking net yeah. from the outside. And I'm like, like no big deal. There's a, if you're watching, like, I had to roll back at this point, Tim, because uh-huh. there's a, like, when they take a big swing and, like, they, he just started screaming, like, yeah, right? Oh, God, yeah. 
If you actually pay attention to the body that is holding on to the net, oh, it's to very net, CGI. Yeah. Well, that is a adult sized body, not a child sized body. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think he's wearing like all the padding of right, yeah. he's, not. Yeah. No, he's not it's all like gone all of a sudden yeah it was just so funny because I was like that is a normal sized body that is not a kid they gave yeah. up <laughs> they clearly did they yeah. were just like okay we're gonna just bring them into the reindeer section and then I'm like are then are you gonna harvest them <laughs> yeah right. well and I had forgotten when he jumps out of jumps off of the net I'm like how is he not going to die? Because I was like, he's going to die. And then he, like, somehow catches the power line. Right, like, he just grabs yeah. it. I'm like, okay, kid. Like, <laughs> eyes closed. You're just hoping for the best. You fucking catch the power lines. Yeah. Aim I mean, for he's the super bush. kid. Yeah. Isn't that the other guy's quote? Yeah. What? And the other guy. Sam- is it Samuel Jackson and then... No, it's uh The Rock. <laughs> yeah, I guess it is Samuel Jackson. Yeah, it's The Rock and Samuel Jackson. They're on the top of a fucking skyscraper. They look at each other, aim for the bush. Oh my gosh. The bush. Wow, they, they completely off. missed it. Oh no. <laughs> Bushes weren't going to save them. No, they weren't. <laughs> nice. It was just funny. Um, But yeah, he catches himself. Mm-hmm. And he's like, Vupe. He doesn't yell Vupe, but. And he right. shimmies down, and then he dramatically opens the gate. Cause it's and doesn't try hard. and find a way back up. He just is like. Tell my dad I love him. No, yeah. tell my dad what tell I him did. What I did. <laughs> oh, right that I love my dad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. And at this point, they have put so much dynamite around Krampus. It's wild. And then they just blow him sky high. Well, well they I first is, cut like, off all the horns. Gonna, okay. Yeah. Those horns would be a lot heavier than that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they just like <laughs> carried him out. But I was like, oh, they're just gonna free him like faster. I know. It was like, there's a certain level of explosives that'll just crack the shell. Yeah. And I shocked that it killed him. Well, they went overboard. They put a lot in there. <laughs> and did you notice that the entire bottom of it was filled? No, but. Also, where was, there was not a single girl in this film. Yeah, that's wild. Right? A single girl. <laughs> There wasn't, like, any women in this film at all. Like, not even one. On a phone or something. Like, you didn't even hear a woman's voice. That's crazy. That's weird. Right? I just, I realized that when we were watching, I was like, the fuck? Yeah, that's crazy. Maybe there's one in extra. In Where's extra? Mrs. Claus? That's part two. Mrs. Krampus. Rare exports again. <laughs> Anywho, so they blow him up. And, like, <coughs> the guy's, like, the dad is, like, watching it. And I thought that was funny that he never looked away and then his hat blows off all dramatically. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. It just flops away. Oh, that's yeah. Great. And this was the part where I expected some cool, fun, like, giant Santa kill everyone moments. <laughs> and then he was just dead. And he was and then I, them. <laughs> we, But we didn't see him die. Nope. So, true, so it leaves open for a sequel. That's true. We'll just know that he's hornless. He's not horny. They grow He's back. Horny. He's not horny. He'll have little... I'm on Team Santa. <laughs> Tim seen Hellboy. He grows them <laughs> yeah, back. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was thinking of. He'll have like little nubs. Um, <laughs> yeah. And like, I just want to say that they blew up every single person's radiator. Oh, they're going to be so That'd mad. Be a cold winter. Yeah. Yeah, Finland's not warm. I think they'll be able to buy them with apparently they were able to sell these things for 16 million dollars a year a year I thought yeah it, i, I thought, thought they, they were, were just like... selling the what they had is eighty five thousand a piece but who would buy these old men that are just that's like, what I don't we understand. were saying <laughs> i mean i do ha- not understand tanzania 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 yeah. they went through like uh tanzania <laughs> they went through this great santa claus training camp though right Where, like fucking creepily ass strokes their face like <laughs> if santa put his hand on my face i think there'd be lawsuits craziness yeah like in the u.s yeah well and there's that one santa who was not understanding it yeah. he was well, joking. and he, he was, was joking, joking his, his child his that's great yeah and so and then yeah like tanzania buys them but like clearly a bunch of people bought them 
I don't know why. I don't understand. Yeah, like they're well, rare exports, guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it's like, oh, these were Santa's elves, but they're actually Santas now. So ha 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 ha, buy them. Yeah. They just don't know. They don't. They're getting fake Santa. Right. Mm-hmm. They. But they're just gonna like sell the one and only mythical Santa. Yeah. But well, for a only bunch eighty-five thousand dollars. Yeah, it's a good deal, Tim. I don't understand why deal. you don't get it. <laughs> just talk to your bank, get a loan, and you'll get a free Santa. Yeah. I'm Who gonna needs put a him house? Out every a every winter, I'm gonna put him out. <laughs> just waves. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go back in the basement, you <laughs> cretin. <laughs> oh I'll throw you some bones and shit or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why, but next I, always, year. I always pictured them eating rabbits. Well, they eat reindeer, clearly. I don't think they, they eat, eat anything. They eat gingerbread. Yeah. Yeah, they do. Why did that work? <laughs> oh. I didn't understand that. Maybe the gingerbread's made of um, flesh. Ew. Uh, it's a lot creepier when somebody says flash. Yeah. Well, and there was one other line that I thought was hilarious. Was like right at the beginning, Pietro's like, he's trying to explain it to you, so. And he's like, everything we know about Santa's a lie. The Coca Cola <laughs> Santa's a lie. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I was yeah. like, oh my God. What's funny is I'm used to it being like that Disney Santa. Yeah. Like, insert, like the Disney Cinderella. Yeah, no, it's the Coca Cola Santa. Yeah. Well, I guess that is a Santa. Like, he mm-hmm. shares a Coke with the polar bears every year. Yeah. <laughs> That's a very terrible life choice. Those polar bears would destroy him. Eh. Worth the yeah. gamble. Magical being and whatnot. Um, but yeah, they all live happily ever after. <laughs> Making fatty Apparently. cash off some Santas. I know. Some rare exports. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but dumps. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so Tim, you got any more notes? How not. confused were you on a scale of 1 to 10 by the end? <laughs> I wasn't confused at all by the end. <laughs> How disappointed were you that there you really only just saw Krampus and Ice? Oh, I wanted it so bad. <laughs> they didn't have the budget, so okay? <laughs> I, you know, I ran the buy as well, and I was like, yeah, probably. But really, the story didn't have any room like, for them to fight him. I don't know what they would have done. I would have been more sad yeah. for them to fight him than it would have been. Like, I was like, Krampus just got to win, right? <laughs> like, Yeah. They have like no way to fucking Krampus beat him. Movie. Like, he just wins. Like, We never saw that. Movie. But how did Spoiler a creature alert. go from... Yeah. Wait, what? We never saw the new Krampus You need film. to watch it. I <laughs> Was that on our recommended list? It I'm going to look. It is, isn't it? I, think so. I might be changing my back movie to now. Back. <laughs> back to back Krampuses. <laughs> but anyway. It'll be in reverse order too because of how we release. Yeah. Anywho. Um, but yeah. Any more notes from anybody? I'll get to the cast even though um I'm so this one I'm gonna be a little different because there's not many finished movies that we know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I'll still read their names and the actors. Mm-hmm. Uh, Pietra mm-hmm. is played by Oni Tomila. Tom, yeah, Tomila. And then his father, Rano, is played by Yorma Tomila. Mm-hmm. then Imo, also known as Finnish Willem Dafoe, mm-hmm. uh-huh. is played by Tommy Corpella. Okay. And then um, Peter Pan, or P. Perinen, is played Rano, by Rano Yovnen. Mm-hmm. Riley, who's Riley, guys? The American that gets a pickaxe in the head. <laughs> gotcha. Is played by Per Christian Ellefson. Okay. And then Yuso is played, Ilmar, played by Ilmari. Oh, there's a lot of dots in this one. Your Veronimpa. Okay. Mm-hmm. I don't know. The director is Yelamari Helander. And this movie won 12 awards and was nominated for two others. Huh. That's amazing. The critics gave this film a 90%. Wow. Audience gave it a 70%. (laughs) IMDb with a 6.7 out of 10 and Google with an 89%. 
And one of the random trivia facts is that Kate Blanchett loves this movie. <laughs> and I was like, how do you even like find that out? Like, yeah. <laughs> that seems like such a weird random information that somebody knew. They're like, like you had to go to her to literally get it to find out. To fact check it. To fact check it. Like there what? <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Um but yeah. Tim. Uh, we'll start uh, with you because you've not seen this film. Sure. Um, um, you flipping this on for the holiday? I mean, it was episode? pretty cool. Uh, future dystopian <laughs> zombie <laughs> movie that I was watching. <laughs> no, but once I got my bearing, yeah, I'm flipping this shit on. This was amazing. <laughs> okay. I was into this the whole time. I, was, I loved it. <laughs> We were like, we were watching this movie and we're like, dude, this is a very, this is like a Tim film. This is a hundred percent my time. I was like, so many people probably hate this movie. <laughs> I know. It's like, actually well liked. I liked. love it. I fucking love it. Only thing that would make it better to me is if Krampus broke out and fucking killed them all. <laughs> Tim's going to make it. Krampus. Sequel. I love Krampus. Tim, we're going to get a Tim cut of it. And he's yeah. going to, like, CGI Krampus just murdering everybody. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> um, but, yeah, like, in, uh, Sam, you can go next, actually. Fuck it. Are uh, you flipping this on? Yeah, I love this movie. I love to show people this movie, and I am a little bit salty that, like, you didn't we didn't, like, person. like I didn't get to watch you watch this, Tim. Because, like, <laughs> that's, like, my favorite One thing those, is, like, yeah. I'm always, like, oh, I have this great Christmas movie. Like, I remember <laughs> when we were in Florida. I was, like, I have this great Christmas movie. Like, and it's kind of like a horror Christmas movie, but you're going to love it. And then people get there, and they're just, like, so traumatized. <laughs> and I just really enjoy it. I don't know. It I'm makes it better person. that it's, <laughs> it's a different language. <laughs> I know. <laughs> well, like, you're bar- you're already, like, it immediately puts you out of like your not like your Christmas comfort zone. Yeah, right. exactly. You're like, okay, I don't know much about Finland. Yeah, well, and the move or the music is like really good. Like it's kind yeah. of you know your typical like horror movie music where it's just kind of in the background making you feel a little eerie, which is good. But I remember when I first watched this, I was like, what the fuck? But obviously, it didn't stop me from watching it. Right. And I just I don't know. I really enjoy it, Adam. Yeah, I'd flip it on. I I too enjoy making people watch it. It's it's just one of those things you got to do, man. Yeah, it's part of the Christmas spirit. It's making somebody look at all of these naked old men. <laughs> <laughs> there are a lot of old man dongs. Yeah, PSA. But, I mean, besides that, there's also... It's nice that it's not, you know, like your typical... Christmas little poopy Plot, movie. Right. You know what I mean? Like, and, and while it is a horror film, it's not like what I assume Krampus horror is film. like. Right. Yeah, it's not like fully there. Like, it's more. Playback. Yeah, we were we were a little concerned you were going to compare it to Krampus the whole time. Like, mm-hmm. like you know how you didn't compare Dune to the 1980s Dune? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Because we haven't seen that one, so we yeah. were like, I don't know how I won't similar be able to it is. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, I think the fact that Cran- the Santa Claus was trapped in the ice made it a little different. Yeah, because you really only see like his horns. Well, you see the old, the millions of Santa books that he has and the drawings yeah. of him, but you never. That's actually, probably like, more like the Krampus stuff, right? Mm. Yeah, but. Anywho, Adam, anything else you want to add about this gem? Um, no? Question mark? Okay. Hi, the Yolua. Wait, is that how you say it? Yeah. Okay. Hi, the Yolua. Merry Christmas in Finland. And dashing through the snow (laughs) on a one horse open play. All the world would go, living all the way. I don't know. Bye. (laughs) <laughs> I was just gonna let you keep going.